How's it going, everybody? I'm Max Preston from SSU TV, and I'm here today at Sonoma State University to present to you Entertainment Group's new segment, Student vs. Food. Let's throw it over to the crew at Meat Pobito and meet our first challenger for the Abuelo Macho Burrito Challenge. Welcome to Student vs. Food. I'll be one of your hosts, Michelle Sucker, and we're here at Ron Art Park's Meat Pobito for the ultimate Abuelo Macho Burrito Challenge. Now tensions are running high inside as Jake gets ready to eat one of the largest burritos these students have ever seen. Amy's inside, so we'll get the scoop. Amy? Okay, so we're in the kitchen of Mi Poblito while he's making the burrito. We're with Miguel and he's cooking chicken right now. We're making with chicken. Uh, we're just gonna put our rice, beans inside the burrito and cheese too. And uh, on top of the burrito, we're gonna make it with put a sour cream, guacamole, and like a cilantro, tomato, onion, and like a special burrito sauce over on top of the burrito. Sounds delicious. He's using four gigantic tortillas for this one burrito. So now he's going to put in some beans. <laughs> you can go closer if you want. Then it looks like there's about three boxes oh of rice God. added. <laughs> Have you ever attempted to eat it? No, never. Never? Will you never try? No, I'm just for me. I usually order the super burrito. That is the famous Mi Pueblito red sauce. Keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, Jake needs to finish this in one sitting. By himself. One whole sitting by himself. I'm having doubts, but I'm hoping Jacob's gonna prove us wrong. Onions. We've got guacamole, famous Mi Pueblito red sauce, onions, tomatoes, cilantro, and it looks like we're dusting our hands off. This might be the end. Oh no. Sour cream. Oh no. Final stage sour cream as it drips off the giant mountain of burrito Jacob, how are you feeling? oh and we're adding some special parmesan cheese, parmesan cheese of course So we're here at Meeple Buto with a few paramedics and I'm just going to ask them a couple of health questions about the burrito challenge. So, do you think it's healthy for a guy to eat a 10 pound burrito in one sitting? Probably not the best for you. It's probably got the caloric intake of two days. <laughs> Have you ever had an emergency phone call from someone eating too much? Uh, no, haven't had that one yet. <laughs> Have you ever had to take someone off the floor because they have eaten too much and they cannot move? Well, over a long period of time when you get someone that weighs about 850 pounds, we have. 
So, why did you guys come to Mipublito today? Uh, for the Mexican food, obviously. Yeah? Is yeah. it your guys' favorite Mexican restaurant here in Runner Park? Yeah, it's one of, yeah. yeah. Very good food. They have good prices, right? Yes, they do. That is the man right there. There he is. The That's man him. So. Ten pound burrito, huh? Do you think he can do it? I'm going to say no. <laughs> <laughs> but I wish you luck. Well, hello, ladies. How are you guys today? Yeah, Pretty good. good. So, you're students of Sonoma State, correct? Yes. yes. And why do you guys come to Mi Pueblito? For the burritos, of course. Yeah? Yeah. Do they have the best prices in town, do you think? Best prices yes. and best burritos. That's great. Have you ever seen the Abuelo Macho Burrito before? No. no. I actually have. I came with a group of my girlfriends, and there were six of us, and we couldn't finish it. Six of you. Mm -hmm. Do you know that there is a competition going on today, student versus food? No. no. Yes, we are having an SSU student try to complete the Abuelo Macho Burrito. Do you think that he can do it? No. I don't think so. I it don't depends know. depends what he looks like. <laughs> depends what he looks like. Why? Are there certain criteria to finish the Abuelo Macho Burrito? Yes. I think a bigger guy would probably do better with it, but who knows? With a bigger appetite. Yeah, yeah. It, it's an indication of his appetite, yeah. Well, folks, you heard it straight from Sonoma State's very own students. We'll see if Jake can do it. <laughs> Well, the competition is just about to start, but before we start, we'd like to speak to Jacob, the actual guy who's going to attempt to eat this massive Abuelo Macho Burrito. Jacob, how are you feeling about this? This thing is as big as, like, my whole stomach. Like, hopefully I'm going to be able to finish it. I was thinking more like your torso, but yeah, yeah it's, it's pretty big. Um, have you ever attempted to eat this much food in one sitting? I have tried, but nothing, compare, nothing compares to this, so... I, I'm going to finish this. How's, how's, so you're confident. Your confidence level is like, what out of 10? 10. It's a 10. It's a 10. Well, we have confidence in you too, and we're going to wish no, you, you luck. Don't. You know. I don't, but I'm going to, you know, prove me wrong. How about that? I believe in you, Jake. Yes. Thank you. We believe in you. Good luck. And we'll see you when you're finished. <laughs> this thing is going yes! down. We're starting off strong. He's sectioning pieces of the burrito off. First bite. This is the first bite, ladies and gentlemen. We are just getting into the nitty gritty burrito challenge. Mm. Oh, it tastes good. Apparently it tastes good. Yeah. It's really good. It's really good? Mm -hmm. If you don't know what's on the inside of it, we have rice, beans, and grilled chicken. It looks tasty, ladies and gentlemen. But that is a lot of food. <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be a while. So. It's gonna be a while. How are you feeling, Jacob? No bueno. No bueno. <laughs> How much longer do you think you can last? Never. Never? <laughs> it looks like the burrito has conquered Jacob. 
he cannot finish anymore. You're not even halfway. Does that disappoint you? Not really. Try, trying my best. It's. I wish I could have eaten all this delicious food. I probably will in the next couple days, but not right now. Do you think you could have trained better? Oh yeah. 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 How so? I think it maybe like actually like saw it in real life instead of like thinking, oh, I saw a picture of it. It looks okay. I can finish it. Well, there you have it. Any, any, if anyone can finish this, they're insane. No, I was confident in the beginning, and I was, but my confidence has been shattered. <laughs>